I'm at uh, IEP right now. Just got done with class about an hour ago. And uh, in the dorm room, getting ready to head out to uh, hunt our first evening in Indiana. We, uh, we found a nice spot last week. So we're going to go uh, load up my truck and hunt this evening. And everywhere and it's really hard to hunt because every single noise is it sounds like a deer but it's just the, the squirrels and raccoons <laughs> <laughs> see it's snowing and raining pretty hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we woke up this morning to about an inch or two of snow on the ground. And, yeah, as the day... Hey Dave, what are we doing? <laughs> we just got to Indiana. We're gonna do some deer hunting. I just caught the camera. I just caught it. Maybe you shouldn't do that. Well, you're probably right. <laughs> Jesus, there's girls coming. <laughs> it's November 8th. We're back at our spot at IUP. And I moved about 50 yards down the hill. 
we're more in the thicket now where we were seeing them last night. Hopefully it's uh, as entertaining as it was last night, as it will be tonight. It's about 65 degrees out. And it's hot. He would be a button bug. <sighs> Ridiculous. Oh, there's another deer. There's three. Head on the monster, 8.15 yards to our left. Biggest buck I've ever seen hunting. Literally 15 to 20 yards to my left. Unbelievable buck. Our, both of us are shaking from uh, how close we got to that, that beautiful buck. He was with a half rack, two point. We haven't seen any does yet. Coming, Dave. Don't move. Don't move. Well, we're walking out of the woods right now and we just had a pretty exciting uh, event that just happened. We were walking out, we got our climbers on and we were walking and all of a sudden 30 yards there was a buck and two does. We hurried up and stopped and Rylan got his camera on him. I got my arrow knocked 
and the buck and one of the does didn't even see us except the one saw us. She was, but she kept coming closer. All of a sudden, that that buck started chasing them. I I got the full draw. They were coming. I thought they were gonna come right in front of us, and she decided to run uh, across the creek and up that big hill. So uh, we got then we got, got to a dead sprint, and we took off down this trail literally running parallel with them along the hill. However, we lost sight of them and it was getting kind of late. We got to go visit with families for Thanksgiving, but wow, what a, uh, it's, it's always when we're walking out, something, something exciting happens. So we'll see you guys Monday on the opening day of rifle. Well, this unfortunately sums up our 2011 archery season. We didn't get a kill this year, but showed you some of our best footage that we got. Yesterday we had a huge eight point come in, but once we went to look at the footage, there was a camera malfunction and we didn't get it on film. So, pretty upset about that, but we know that the season isn't over yet. We have rifle season coming up this Monday, and late archery and bus loader coming up in December. We're excited about that, and we're gonna keep filming. So you guys stay tuned. Beyond the Outdoors TV isn't over yet.